real hard. By whom? Um, by he made this sculpture that um, too strongly referenced apparently this advertisement that a, you know a guy that was a photographer designer made, uh-huh. and that guy sued him. Which is kind of crazy, and he won, which is also crazy because all the copyright laws and stuff, like the Creative Commons, it's kind of like if you change more than like 10 or 20 percent or something, which I think he did change at least that much, but he still lost the laws and stuff. Like the <gasps> Yay, oh, no. it's fixed! Oh, no. Aha! Is that my R? Oh, it's delayed. Okay, man, I won't be able to hear me talking about Jeff. Look, we're on live, guys. We're going to do some airbrushing. I don't know how to turn the volume down. Because <laughs> I do not need to echo myself yeah, twice. Because that's going to be <laughs> real dumb. <laughs> anyway, so I'm on live. Back with the airbrush. And this time, I'm airbrushing with my... Where's my camera? My Iwata. And this one I got on Amazon. And I have this paint here. This is from Japan. It's called Arrow Flash, but I got that on Amazon. And this is the Testor's Airbrush paint, and I got that on Amazon. And if you want, you can find all of these things um, on Amazon. And I have a link to like everything that I'm using, so you don't have to be like, where did she get it from? So my client has already been just gel polished. And what else did I do? And I put matte on there and I put the latex on there. So, super simple, super easy. I'm going to move this up. Not make a mess. I think you guys can see. Yeah, you can actually because. Yeah, cool. So, super simple, super easy. So, hey everybody. I always start spraying a little bit on the towel first and so this is just acrylic paint and I just need a light coat because I'm in a neon so you're gonna pop it with a little white before you neon just to make sure that the color is saturated and that's how we do that and since it's just acrylic paint it's just gonna dry and you do an up and down motion We don't need too much. You can talk while I do it. Oh, okay. If you want to, you don't have to. <laughs> I'm just, and you can you know, see, you don't have that much in there. Feeling the magic. And listening <laughs> to your instructions. <laughs> so, I'm going to hit it with one more soft coat. And I'm going up and down. So, if you look, up and down, up and down, up and down. Because we're going to hit it with neon, so. But you don't want to go and put too much to start. Less is more. Hey, everybody! Like I was saying earlier, if you're looking for airbrush stuff, like what I'm using, I have a link in my bio, and it's in... I have an Amazon Influencer, like, hookup. So, I have everything there that I'm using. So you don't have to go search. Just click there. And get a few things. This is my second coat of white. Just doing a light spray. It's very simple. And this is acrylic paint. So that's all done. You can put your hands in the light. She's just putting her hands in the light for no other reason than it's just going to move them out of the way while I switch out colors. Honestly. <laughs> There's really no reason for that. Like it's going to warm up and make sure everything gets totally set so I'm gonna clean this out and I'm just going to do that because I want most of this white out before I start with the neon because I want it to be true neon this little do that here is my cleaning out pot it just collects everything that's in my Amazon influencer store also I'm going to be extra thorough, and I'm going to use a Q-tip, just to make sure it's out. So, 
I don't know how many people have started doing airbrush, but with the acrylic paint, when you're airbrushing, you have to clean it at the end of the night. You cannot go home without cleaning it. Like, or else you got to take it apart, let it sit in a little water, and get all the paint out. But the acrylic paint dries faster. Ooh, let me have that one. <laughs> the acrylic paint dries faster, and it dries hard. Oh, look at that. <laughs> it smells weird though, right? It doesn't <laughs> smell as good as the other one. The Japanese uh, air gel. And that's what's going to be like. You really weren't getting your nails on. <laughs> yeah, babe. And I got an airbrush. Let me have it head. You don't have to put it in there. So we're just same motion up and down. And I can do it twice, no big deal. I use a matte base before I spray my acrylic paint on because it just makes it easier for it to stick and I don't want to be trying to wipe off a sticky layer or whatever, like you can. I, I just don't want to be bothered with that. So this one that I'm using is the Wildflowers Matte. And I'm gonna hit it one more time on this side just to make sure everything's even. You can see I'm just rolling my client's finger, hitting it. You get more of a truer ombre when you put a little white first, then you do thin coats. There we go. And then what I also notice is if you're gonna do, you can put that one in light. If you're gonna do um, the acrylic paints you do want to make sure it's dried really nice but you also want to make sure you use a shiny top coat because sometimes it'll run if you're going to use a matte top coat make sure it's totally dry all right put that one in there You want a shiny? Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> For sure. For sure. <laughs> so, I know everybody's paying like boatloads of money for airbrush stuff. This little airbrush gun here was 50 bucks. Yep. I, 50, 60 bucks on Amazon. So, if you want that one, it's real simple Amazon. Now, we're going to top coat. All right, I'll take that hand first. This is um, Accents. I'm going to take this same video and uh, share it on YouTube tonight, along with the one from yesterday. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Come through, airbrush. What? I love it. <laughs> It's just like like paintings, like people that make any kind of paint, acrylic or oil painting, when they like pour the varnish on. And yes. Like just videos of them pouring varnish on paint. And they're so excited because it turned out exactly how they want it. Yeah. Yes, that's how I feel. When the nail look turns out like you want it, you're like, whoa, <laughs> it's even better than I imagined. And I've been watching a lot of those acrylic pour mm -hmm. where they do the, oh my God. Okay, so I want to do that. You can take the hand out. I also don't want to make that kind of mess in my house. I feel like <laughs> I'm already messy enough. And I just, I don't need that kind of stress at the house. But I really <laughs> want to do it. Yes. Okay, put that one in the light. We about to be out here killing them with this neon ombre. Y'all not ready. <laughs> it's cool. Y'all not ready. You know what I'm saying? Like, come on, man. Soft. I ain't even have to mix no two acrylic colors. I just flexing on. <laughs> what? You're just funny. <laughs> <laughs> I know. It's been a long day. <laughs> like I've been here. I literally have almost been here all day. Well, I had a break in the middle to go get my eyelashes done. Did you eat anything? <laughs> I did. I ate a little. Um, I had some Chinese food. So apparently I'm only eating like Chinese food and like eating like once a day and drinking lots of liquids. 
Yeah, yeah, but it's fine. It's fine because <laughs> I got a little bit left, so I'll just eat the rest of that. I will. I will. Take that hand out. Okay. I'm not gonna cure this all the way sixty seconds on the first coat because I'm gonna end up adding just another real thin coat of top coat on this. How does it look? It looks really good. Ah! Put this one in there. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> when you go to work tomorrow, they're gonna be like, "Oh, I don't want to give you that." Oh! We'll be touching your hands and everything. <laughs> yes. Right. Oh, for everybody out there in Instagram land, I am doing a class. I only have uh, four spots left for my class coming up February 17th and 18th. It is, um, what is that, President's Day weekend? It's a Sunday and a Monday. So if you're still interested in the class... Filling up, which means if you don't pay, you might not get a seat. We'll take your other hand out. I don't know about anybody else, but when I do two coats of top coat, I do not fully cure that first coat because I want it to still be able to accept that second coat. So I don't need it fully cured. And it can fully cure all together. So this is her last coat of top coat. Put that one in the light. And then we're going to get this other hand and top coat that. And then a little bit more him. Then I'm going to, that's it. She's going to be on her way. She's going to go home. And try not to stare at her awesome nails. <laughs> and the little stones. Oh, yeah. Whoa. I forgot that. Here, put that one in here. Oh, what size do you want to use? Um, I like the little black ones. Can you show me? Black me? ones? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Not those. Those? No, those? No, not those. Okay, well, tell me which ones. Which ones? I, feel, I pulled I out, know. oh, here you go. I pulled like 77 different things. <laughs> you take your other hand out. These. These? Whichever ones you think. Okay. <laughs> Real excited. Got some Swarovski's up in here. And the cold don't get me. Because I always say, I always say absolutely. Absolutely wrong. Or do you want, like, do you want this big size or like this teeny size? Can I see up close? Now? Yeah. Um, I guess this one? Yeah, the big one. Okay, cool. So we're going to put some stones too. So the day just gets even better. <laughs> I don't need this. Uh -huh. <laughs> so we need something for stones. This is um this is from Designer Nail Supply. Uh, I just need something to get it out with. My crystal cantana has seen better days. <laughs> but it still works. Just gonna put it at the mm -hmm. yeah, okay. So we're going to add some stones. This is the fun part. I'm going to do that one second. Because we're going to cure, flash cure this real quick in the light. Mm. When you want to come through dripping. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm like, where do you go? Oh, I go get my nails done by a crazy person. <laughs> <laughs> She's intense. You're fun. Yes! <laughs> I am. To make sure this is good, I want a little bit more flow back. I want a little bit more... There we go. Because I want to be able to create a little. This is how you know I've done this before. Because <laughs> it ain't no problem. I'm like, nah, I got it. 
it's a specific way that I like it. There we go. To pillow out, to kind of hold it on there. So you're going to cure that for me. Just give me 10 seconds. I'll take me and take it out. Take this guy right here. Did you see this somewhere? No, I just... She's an artist, guys. <laughs> She's, she does lots of awesome art. Like, huge installation pieces. And that one friend that hypes you up. Yes. <laughs> hypes you up and be like, no, 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 no. She got a new doc. She's the head doctor over at uh, Baptist. Like, what? Like, no, no, in reality, she's like a medical assistant. <laughs> <laughs> No, no, but she actually does do yeah, large like, installation. No, yeah, yeah she <laughs> legit. I'm just telling you guys, I'm, I'm good at the hype. <laughs> in the light, the light in the way. What, Brie? Oh, you right. My bad. Thanks. No lights on. Boom! The lights out the way. <laughs> You probably need to have this come with like you can take oh, that she, one out. Oh my gosh, yeah, it's been longer. Than <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> mm -hmm. Boom! Put that one in there. <laughs> now we're gonna do the thumb separate. So take a little bit. And you know what's funny is I got this whole setup over here so that I can see both sides. Not even paying attention. <laughs> Thumb. I'm gonna take the other hand out. Put this one in there. Um, yeah, not even paying attention. Like barely looking. <laughs> but you know what I didn't expect? Like the little delay. Like, yeah. Mm -hmm. Like I know. I mean, obviously, it can't be recording. Like, it can't be real time. It can be real time, but it's got to be a delay because it's still transmitting. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I never thought about that. Yeah. I'm just going to take a little bit. Just your thumb. We don't need this. This is from... This is from Designer Nail Designer Nail Products 3D Jewelry Gel. I literally want to peel the pink stuff so bad. Just watch. Bree, I can't even deal. So when I put the latex on, on, on Bree, she wants to peel it off. And I'm like, this is to protect your finger. Like, I need it on there. Don't peel it off. Like, that's my job. This is how I make them stay. I get a little top coat, take the other hand out. Okay, so how I make them stay is I get some top coat and I get a thin liner brush. So, hand is there. I get some top coat, I get a thin liner brush and I put some top coat on the silicone mat. And then after I do a coat, I go around to make sure it's fully covered. And also remember, my client is taking like maybe an eighth of an inch off your nail. So, you know, if you get into a knife fight, you might lose it. <laughs> I mean, I doubt you'll get into a knife fight, but whatever. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, maybe. It's hard out here in these art world streets. <laughs> Man, at those conferences. Right. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta find where you spot. <laughs> Talks get heated. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Have you ever seen that video with those two little kids and they're like, it's sprinkling! It's raining! And then like the one little girl pokes the little boy in the chest. He's like, oh, you poked my heart. <laughs> it's so freaking cute. But they were legit like about to go to blows over if it was sprinkling or raining. It was so funny. My mom said it's sprinkling. <laughs> like, what? <laughs> This is it, guys. Yeah, 
Okay, put that in there. We're just going to do 10 seconds and I'm going to do your thumb. So, like, count to 10 and then that's it. Yeah. I like that song by Ed Sheeran. I'm on my way. I'm like what? How close are you? Call <laughs> 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 first. Right. Is this a text or like are you asking me if you can come over, sir, or are you just gonna show up? <laughs> Um, I don't know if anybody's going to the Bronner Brothers show that's coming up in January, February, March. I don't want to put too much top coat. I just want enough to like give everything. That's coming up in March, but I am going. I will be at the show only on the 31st for Lauren Boyd's class. She's doing a art class. Who's texting me while I'm doing it? Thanks. 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 For all the notifications while I'm busy. <laughs> People want from me. Nicole is asking me to do something. I don't know, Nicole. I can't read it just yet. Mm. I don't see any comments that say I'm not, that they can't see. Everybody can see. This is just how I make my stone stay on. <laughs> yeah, people want to know that. Like, how you make yours stay on? And then, like, when you come back in a month, like, uh, they're still on. I'm like, that's a challenge to you. Ten seconds. Challenge to you. Yeah, I mean, yeah. I, think I usually do a good job when I'm messing them up too bad. Yeah, actually, you and really do. They seem pretty durable. Don't listen to her. They're durable, but that doesn't mean use them for stuff. Oh, yeah, no. Yeah, I don't mean. <laughs> jo- those are jewels, not tools. Yeah. Yeah. I don't do any crazy stuff. <laughs> You're like, no. I don't know. <laughs> I try not to get any paint or, paint or ink or anything on them. Yeah, because it can get all stainy. Like me with the daggone markers once. And then I discovered alcohol ink, so then of course I was like <laughs> a whole new thing. So put just your thumb. You do your thumb for 10 seconds, and after that, you're going to do your whole hand. And now I'll tell you when to take it out. Take it out. All right, that's cool. You got your whole hand? Yeah. All right, cool. Mm, your whole hand in. Okay. okay. Like, just in for like... Just in. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> now people know that I'm actually crazy in real life. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> the people that don't know me are like, okay, so she's a little... She's a little off. <laughs> it's cool. It's cool. My dog likes me. <laughs> that was like a meme or something. I'm gonna make a shirt that says like, it's cool. My dog likes me. <laughs> <laughs> like what? Like he does. He doesn't care. Just shut them. And you're gonna do it for ten seconds and then after that you're gonna take your hand out and put your whole hand in. Your whole hand is in all the way? Yeah. Alright. Alright. So uh I will post a final picture later <laughs> tonight. But we are all done. I'm gonna clean up. Thanks guys for joining. problematic <laughs> like ending the dumb video right <laughs> how are you gonna do it i don't know I'm-